Hey my beautiful souls, welcome back to Finding with Jessie, the life coach. So today is all about travel, yes travel. So I have a small little mini trip coming up and I'm going to be showing you how I pack, the things I take with me to make sure I am staying organized, I'm staying on top of things, I'm not losing things, I'm staying entertained, I'm staying healthy, I'm staying protected. Yeah, so we're going to get into all of it. So grab a drink, get ready. I'm going to show you how I do it. I lay everything out first on my bed just to see what I'm taking with me and then I get started with the big things. First thing I'm going to start with is my accessories bag. So guys, if you haven't hit that subscribe button hit it so let's go we're gonna talk about toiletries first first up so first thing I'm gonna talk about is my travel bag so this is a bag from person person is a luxurious high-end travel accessories company and they sell travel bags so what I love about this bag is that it has handles but not only that but in the bag it has a hidden hook so I love that it's versatile you can actually hang it especially now during COVID and we're learning about so much bacteria and viruses we want to make sure we're keeping our stuff off of surfaces so it actually has two sides both sides have a zipper enclosure one has a strap in the inside and the other side is more fluid I'm going to unzip it it actually um, unzippers and the whole enclosure flips all the way to the other side so you have access to everything it comes with five removable pouches which I love because I like to um, compartmentalize my items I talked about this before I like everything having a home that's how I stay organized it has that kind of Tiffany trough look which I love because it makes it look so much um, like luxurious and elegant and timeless on the bag it actually has a clip feature so you can actually clip in your pouches so the pouches do not fall when you actually hook them and you forget to actually um, zipper them all around you know zipper them in so I love that feature and what's great about that feature what makes it so versatile is if you actually wanted to take the pouches out which a lot of the times I do depending on you know where I'm traveling or travel trips are not equally the same so you use different things you know um, different size trips but if you take them out um, you can actually use the case in its own just like a train case so a lot of people you know let's say you know you're going away and you don't want to depod your items such as your big shampoos your big your big lotions and things of that sort you can do that with this bag all you have to do is take the little pouches out and then um, in the inside just use the case as is and I'm gonna show you what I mean like if you have like big um, makeup palettes like eyeshadow palettes and things of that sort you can actually just throw it in and use it as so so I love that about this place that's very versatile and like I said sometimes I take other trips I don't need all of this and I just use the pouches um, and I could use them in different things I could put them in like my handbag I could put it in um, you know the bag that I'm taking to fly and so on and so forth so I digress let's go back so one thing I love about these pouches the first two actually have compartments like they have dividers within the compartments I'm gonna show you what I mean so as you can see there's three different compartments so I love that my things stay separate this one I usually use for like my q-tips my facial pads and just um, cotton puffs and I use that for you know obvious reasons <laughs> The other one behind it actually has the same it has three different pouches but not only that with this pouch you can actually use the front of it as well as you can see it's like very spacious so I'm gonna show you what I mean usually I use this for makeup and I actually put I'm gonna put right now a blush palette a, bl a, bleh, a blush palette from NARS so it's a small little palette and then in the front I'm gonna put um, another a blush palette right in the front so that's what I mean it actually separates some and when you're looking for it what I love about that is that you could just find it you just put your hand in and you find it so um, I love those two um, sections I love that it's clear I love that it's see-through I also love that some of the pouches have the vegan leather so it's actually made out of vegan leather on some of them have it on the top some of them have it on the back the whole you know um, bag itself is made with vegan leather so I love that um, so now that I talked a little bit about it I'm gonna actually show you how I fill these bad boys up but quickly if you're looking for a good toiletry bag make sure you check out the zippers the zippers are super important what you don't want to do is invest in a bag and then the zippers are falling apart and then you have to keep on buying it over and over and over and over again that's why I like to invest in more quality pieces because they last longer so now we are going to flip it I'm gonna show you a little bit of this other side so this side here in concept right um, 
different use. So it zippers, but it only zippers about one fourth um, of the way down. And the reason for that is because this is meant to hold up bottles. That's why you have um, that little strap on the inside. It actually comes with two additional pouches, but these pouches are um, designed for specific things. The small one is designed for your razor. So that's what I have in here. I have my travel razor in there, and then I have the travel cartridges, like a backup cartridge, and you can see how spacious it is in the inside. One feature that I love about this bag is that it has plastic all over the place. Even though it has that pink, um, beautiful, like that blush pink um, color to it, it's you know engrossed in it, but on the top of it has plastic. These two small pouches also have the little hook, so you can actually hook it to that line to make sure that the bags don't fall out. The second pouch that it comes with is meant for your toothbrush. So in here I have my little scope, I have my travel toothpaste, and then I have this little UV light protector. And what this is guys is actually for to make sure that you're staying clean with your toothbrush. Make sure your toothbrush is staying free of bacteria. The way you use it is you just basically open it, take out your toothbrush. I have an electric toothbrush, um, so it works with all types. And you actually just press the button. Um, I don't think you can really see because of the light. I'm trying to see if it's on, but um, it turns a bluish color and it has three dots on the top. Once those uh, dots turn, I think it's yellow, uh, that means that it cleaned your toothbrush. So that's good because, you know, you want to make sure that we're staying clear of bacteria and viruses and uh, we're staying clean. So like I said, it has that plastic inside the um, interior of the bag, which makes cleaning it real easy. So right now I have a little bit of toothpaste. I don't think it shows too much on camera, but all I have to do is take a makeup wipe and literally just wipe it clean and the whole thing is clean again. So I love that about it. Um, and like I said, they're pretty spacious in the inside. So this bag can actually hold more than one toothbrush, which, you know, I love that as well. And of course, this is what it was designed for um, the way it is marketed is meant for toothbrush holding and the other one's meant for a razor but literally you can use these bags for whatever you want to use the bags for it's it's your item or my item so i could use it how i want to but it works very well for those two items so i'm going to show you a little bit of the design on the other side it's meant to hold big bottles this here is my tatcha um, essence and it's a pretty large bottle and here is my toner so I'm putting them in so the point of strap is so it actually can stand and stay upright and that's why the plastic only comes down one fourth. So it's just a, a backup mechanism to make sure it stands upright, it stays upright. But this here, this bottle, just to let you know, look, you, you can see that it's spilled all over the place. So this bottle is not meant for that. No matter how, how much it stays upright, just the design of the cap is spilled all over the place. So right now I have toner all over my bag. Um, I don't think you can really see it on camera, but comparison in comparison to this bottle, which is the Tatcha Essence, it actually has that little, it's like a like a little scoop. It's 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 a different design that helps it to not pour out. So the other bottle was not designed as well, but it's also much cheaper than the Essence. So you know, sometimes you get what you pay for. Majority of the time, you get what you pay for. But the great thing about this bag, once again, like I said, it's easy to wipe, which is what I love about it. I would always suggest when looking for a toiletry bag, make sure it's easy to clean. Very important. So I'm actually going to uh, close this up and now I'm going to start filling up the bag, right? I'm going to mention one other feature about it. It's actually expandable. As you can see, it has three zippers in the bag and there's a reason for that. So um, obviously one zipper is to close it, one zipper is to open it tight and then on the top it has an, an additional zipper. So if you zip that all the way around, it actually gives you about, I think it's like two to three inches more of, of additional space. So this is great, especially when you start filling up your pouches with items like toiletries and makeup and things of that sort. You're gonna need the space, you're gonna need the room. Expansion is a great quality to look for in a bag. I'm going to expand it now because I'm going to start filling it up and show you guys what I am taking with me on my vacation. So this is a quick getaway, it's only three, three days? It's only three days. It's gonna be a Friday to Sunday trip and I'm gonna show you how I pack. So my first bag, my pouch is already packed. My second one, I'm actually gonna be taking this in my handbag. So I'm gonna put this to the side and then we're gonna start filling up the last three. So my first pouch, I'm gonna start with makeup. I'm going to fill it up with my IT CC cream, which actually has 50 SPF. I'm going to fill it up with my MAC 
finishing powder, um, two different blushes, one Outlaw by NARS, and then Blush Copper by Becca. I am actually taking my Tatcha, um, what is this? It is a primer, and then I'm taking a pair of tweezers, it actually has a light, and then I'm taking my Flower Bomb little perfume, and we are going to pack that all up, right? In my second pouch, it's all about facial care. So the first thing I have in there is my Sunday Riley Vitamin C Oil. The second thing I have in there is my Tatcha um, Vitamin C Brightening Serum. Then I have my Tarte Maracula Oil. Then I have my Sunday Riley uh, Retinol Sleeping Night Oil. And then I have a lip duo from Sarah Harp. One is exfoliator and one is a lip balm. So you gotta take care of your lips, especially on vacation, guys. So the last thing I'll be throwing there is my eye serum when I travel. So um, the last pouch is going to have an Anastasia palette, I'm going to have my Anastasia um, eyebrow pencil, I'm going to put in there a mascara, and um, beside my mascara I'm going to have um, just my eyebrow setting gel, we don't want to be melting on vacation, <laughs> and then I'm going to have two lip glosses, one from Gerard's Cosmetics which has a little light in it which I love. And I'm actually going to be taking um, one from Anastasia, that's a lip gloss, and then um, more of a brightening um, lip gloss, and then an under eye concealer. And literally, those are my pouches. I have two filled with makeup, one filled with skincare, and literally that is all I need for this small little getaway. I'm actually going to... Um, Put them nice and compact i'm gonna actually strap them down so i make sure that everything is staying in alignment it's not falling all over the place once the pouch has been expanded there is plenty of room for other things such as the toothbrush um, pouch and the razor pouch and a couple of other things you want to drop in there so one thing i'm going to drop in there is just a little um eyeshadow duo i don't wear a lot of eyeshadow or eye makeup um but we are going out um one night so i'll be adding that and then i'm gonna add my tarte um spf uh brush so we want to make sure that even though it's not going to be super hot that i am being protected from the sun then on the other side i actually have little small bottles of tatcha products i use a lot of tatcha for my face like this is the essence of smaller product but i found a new way to actually compact my stuff so i actually found these travel bottles off of amazon i love them so the way it works is basically there are travel bottles inside there's four of them you depod your big items into there and then you just turn the top and it actually clicks to the item that you know you need so in here is where i am going to keep everything i need such as my essence such as my facial soap my body wash um creams and all of that my um moisturizer i'm actually taking some facial pads i always would suggest that i'm actually taking some eye masks for under my eyes because I want to relax and the last thing I'm taking is my facial brush and literally I am all set to go this is my neck cream and as you can see it's from Tarte it's pretty big so I just depotted it into a smaller version and then that's it I don't like to take big bulky um, items on vacation for like a three or four day weekend and I have everything in here so I love this bag because it fits everything nice and comfortable People always ask me why I keep the tags on my bags. I just do. I just, I, I keep it on until it falls off. So let's talk makeup brushes. So this is one of my newest little traveling um, items that I got off of Amazon. It's a brush holder. And I have several, but I love the way how this one is so compact inside. It actually has little hoops to hold your brushes in place and it keeps it upright, which I love. So as us women, we know we have several makeup brushes for different things, powder brushes, one to, you know, put on your compact, one to um, highlight, one to contour, you know, eyebrow brushes, you know, I have kabuki brushes to just set my powder and things of that sort. So I love how it just keeps everything nice and compact and it's upright, it's clear, it's see-through and it's easy to clean. So I love this little pouch. So let's discuss how I pack my instruments. So I actually have this little pouch. I got this off of Amazon as well. I love it. It's supposed to be um, a bra. On the back side, it's completely flat. And in the far front, it actually forms like a bra. When you open it, it has a section here that is for your panties, your, under, your undergarments, and then the front is for your bra. So I'm actually going to start filling it up. I have a, here a sachet that actually is scented, so I love to you know, bring it in there. Um, it's in the shape of a bra, so in the back I'm putting some underclothes at the bottom of a bathing suit. So I'm actually packing one of my bathing suits and just um, two bras in here and it fits nice and comfortable. 
and I'm actually able to just sip it up and keep everything together so I love this little pouch it's just so cute and so feminine I just love it so that's how I pack my intimates so when we talk about intimates we have to talk about the beach right so I'm here I'm taking three items for the beach this is my wet bag I don't go anywhere without this wet bag I am the type of person that goes to the beach to the pool last minute right before I go anywhere so I take it with me everywhere I'm taking another he's kind of looking bathing suit in here and then in there I have just my aloe my suntan lotion and just you know some protection now where we are going they do not have towels they're not supplying towels so i'm actually taking a travel this is actually a travel towel it's super thin it's lightweight it's super small and it's perfect for travel it's actually a travel towel so it's actually made from a company called monster it has its own little pouch the pouch has ventilation through it so if it's wet it dries pretty quickly it has like a nice little hoop so you can take it camping or wherever you want to go so i love this little item and it's coming with me now let's talk about staying healthy so i actually take my vitamins my, most of my vitamins are gummies because i hate to swallow pills so i actually have this pill organizer which has the days of the week so it's perfect for staying organized staying healthy so i'm going to deposit some of these gummies into here and make sure i am getting my vitamins while i am away so one of the most important things about organizing is making sure you are prepared for any situation so i do not go anywhere without my emergency bag so this bag, I just took a nice clear traveling bag and just filled it with travel size medications and emergency items. So I have things like hauls in here, tissue, I have ointments for cuts and bruises, I have emergency packets, I have vitamin C packets, I have blowfish which is items for hangovers, I have wet ones, I have everything, Pepto-Bismol, I have Advil, I have Tums. I have tampons in here, I have allergy medication, I have nose strips, I have sanitary wipes, feminine sanitary wipes to make sure you're staying nice and clean. And I do not go anywhere without this. This has saved me so many times. So let's talk about sanitary and protection. So this little device I got off of Amazon and it is a UV light that actually can clean your linen and it also sanitizes surfaces. Best product ever. Now let's talk about protection. If you're used to staying in Airbnbs and hotels and you go it alone or you do girl trips, you need this. This is a backup lock that actually protects from the inside. No matter if you have the key, they can't get it. So for me, I suffer from allergies, so I don't go nowhere without my traveling humidifier. I love this thing. It works on a battery or, or it can work just wireless. And basically, you actually just dump it in a cup and you just fill it with water and you instantly have a humidifier. It's great if you actually um, have um, dry skin and things of that sort. So it helps you sleep better. Let's talk entertainment electronics. So for this trip, I'm going away for a bachelorette party. A lot of people could not attend and we actually still in the middle of COVID restrictions. So one thing I am going to do because I am the host is I am going to be zooming people into our bachelorette fun and our celebration. So I'm taking this projector so I actually we, we can be able to see everybody nice and big. And we also could use it for entertainment if you want to watch movies outside or on the beach or wherever because it actually has Wi-Fi and apps. So all you actually have to do is connect it and you're good to go. So I'm actually taking this speaker. This is my portable speaker because we need some music and some tunes on the beach. We're also doing a boat ride. So this is perfect. Just my JBL little speaker. It comes with its own little case. It has this USB so you can charge it. It's wireless. It hooks to everything. So I love it. Now let's talk luggage. Since it's only a three day trip, I am taking a duffel. So this is my leather duffel from J Mangano. I love it because it's actually two tier. It actually has an internal uh, zipper that separates the bottom from the top so you can put all your bags or shoes and things on the bottom or the top however you want to do it and then you can just separate your clothes. So I'm big on bags of this sort and I'm actually going to be taking this. I'm actually going to start filling up the bottom. The bottom is actually more spacious. So I'm going to be filling that up with all my toiletry bags and all my bags that I just showed. As I always tell people, all luggages are not created equal and you need different luggages for different trips. The same thing as, you know, toiletry bags and things of that sort. So it's always good to have multiple um, different bags for different trips. What I also love about this bag is that it has four internal pockets. So it's good for little things. So we're going to talk about my carry-on bag. So I'm actually not flying anywhere. It's actually a road trip. We're going to be on the road for five to six hours. 
so it's gonna be a little heavy so I actually need a bag that's gonna keep me nice and organized and I love this little bag from um, Joe Mangano and actually has an interior organizer which I love because I don't like to fumble through my bags I always su would suggest to people if you're looking for a nice travel bag make sure there's organization within it or something that you can add inside of it to organize your stuff um, or just get little pouches to make sure that you um, you know keep everything in its compartment so this here actually has multiple little pockets it has different um, little uh, pockets for you know credit cards and things of that sort and this is gonna come in really handy because I have a lot of little things I like to keep in my bag like I said it's a five to six hour trip guys so um, I want to make sure that I am comfortable so I'm gonna show you how I am going to start organizing this bag and what I am taking for my car ride I'm just gonna clip it back in and I'm gonna get started um, but I love that the bag also has on each side room to you know just drop things in so we're gonna be talking about the necessities I'm gonna be taking in the car so when I am traveling for long distances I like to be comfortable so I like to invest in pouches that are double-sided this pouch actually has a space on the top and space on the bottom on the top I'm gonna open it so you can actually see how much space it has um, it's pretty roomy and then when you flip it to the other side it has another side where you can add items it's not as the depth is not as um, big but a good amount fits in here and so like I said I like to be comfortable so this is where I'm gonna put necessities I'm going to need in the car so the first thing I am going to start with is going to be my selfie stick <laughs> It sounds funny because I said necessities like why is it selfie stick a necessity but I like to take pictures I love to um, save my memories and I love this selfie stick because not only is it a selfie stick but it also stands alone um, and you can actually take pictures it has actually a remote that's attached to it so it has you know a Wi-Fi remote so it's great for group pictures and things of that sort when you have no one to take you know to take your picture so um, I love this you know it collapses down and I'm actually gonna be putting this in my bag because I'm gonna be taking pictures on the road you know it's memories people <laughs> so the second item I'm going to be taking is this portable fan now I love this little gadget now um, it is just amazing it's actually a charger right and then you actually can charge it, it charges by USB as well it's also a flashlight um, so on the bottom it actually has um, a flashlight so that's great like if you put it in your purse and you lose something in your purse or you need a flashlight you have it right there you can't find your phone and then um, it actually turns into a fan it actually stands up by itself or you can hold it and I love it now I'm one of those people that sometimes get gets car sick in the car and I get really hot and all this kinds of stuff <laughs> happens to me so I like that I don't have to bother anybody because I have just my portable fan. So, so instead of asking someone to lower windows or turn on the AC because you're hot, I can just control it myself. I like being very independent and relying on me. So the next thing I actually am carrying in this pouch is a portable air purifier. So you actually wear it as a necklace and it has two filters on the top and it's great, especially in this current climate where there's viruses and bacteria. This actually is clearing, clearing and cleaning the air. And all you do is just wear it over your neck. So I love that. It's a great way to fight um, viruses and make sure you're protecting yourself. So I'm going to flip it to the other side. And this side I filled more with feminine wipes, wet ones, a travel brush. I have a Too Faced setting spray so I use that as a refresher just for my face. I actually have a contact case here that actually has a little section for a solution and a contact case just in case I need it, an extra mirror, and then I always travel with an extra pair of contacts. Mine are disposable and you never know when you're going to lose one or something goes wrong, you rip it. So it's always good to have a backup and then I actually like to moisturize my lips so I have this balm from um, Tatcha. I have another one but I packed it in the suitcase so this is the one for my ride. And I always keep a nail clipper because you, every time you travel, it's like your nails break. There's always something going on. So it's great to just have it. Um, so I have it nice and it's right at my disposal. I don't have to worry about what I packed because I have it with me. So I love this little um, case because it's just double sided and keeps everything nice and organized and together, which is what I love. So the next thing I am taking is going to be my little essential oils. So this is a relaxing lavender mix. So I have the pillow mist. I have one to um, like a roller ball, um, and then I have one to actually spray. So this is just great for relaxing. If I want to take a nap, you know, um, if I just want to make sure that I'm just 
making sure I'm calming my energy down just helps me so um, yeah it definitely I definitely want to take a nap in a five to six hour road trip and this is gonna help me do it so I love my rollables I also use it to sleep at night so it just helps me just relax so this is the pouch that I had on my toiletry bag and I'm gonna use it for my purse so I have hand sanitizer I actually have a um, this is a ring just to actually uh, make sure that you are putting your purse on the ring instead of like putting it on the the table this is a hand lotion and then um, this is potpourri I don't know if you guys know about this but when you need to take a poop you spray it in the toilet bowl so it doesn't smell and you need this when you travel with anybody so, so it's a must have when you do group trips okay because nobody wants to smell all of that now this item is portable hand soap so they're dry they're in a container you just add water to it and you clean your hands so this is great especially when you're going on a road trip because there's never soap in the bathroom something else I would mention is taking a travel toilet tissue which it's a must on a road trip because you are going to make several stops and you need to make sure you're prepared so I always actually have to have body lotion on me I actually found these cute bags in TJ Maxx and um, it's a great way to just deposit your regular big lotions into the smaller pouches I suffer from eczema so if it's too hot um, the air is too dry I actually go into itchy <laughs> itchy attacks so I have to make sure I'm moisturizing my skin so something else I take it's a little portable nail kit and that's what's in here so the next thing that's going in my travel bag is going to be my laptop I have um, a Mac Air which is 11 inches it's pretty lightweight which is great and it's small so I'm actually going to be putting it in this protector I got it off of Amazon and it's great because it's nice and cushioned in the inside I actually have a hard case but it's great for extra protection and then I actually have um, this little case to store my chargers so I don't I'm not taking a lot of chargers I'm just taking the charger for my laptop inside it actually has a divider so you can take it out if you have bigger chargers or you can divide two sides but here I'm just putting my laptop charger and then a charger for my portable battery which I'm going to show in a second and that's all I need and I love that this little pouch has a little handle so you can just pull it out right out of your bag you don't have to go digging for anything and it says chargers right on it so this is my portable battery it's by halo I spoke about this before in one of my car organization videos because it also is a car starter so I usually leave this in my car but I'm taking it with me on the top you can actually um, put your phone to charge it is a flashlight um, it has a flood light it has all these emergency lights within it but what it does is it just charges everything wireless it has um, USB ports and then on the other side it actually has a plug so this is how I'm going to charge my laptop in the car when it dies out and I don't have to rely on anyone or take turns when I need to charge things I have my own so this thing here is a portable eye massager I love this thing I don't go anywhere without it it is just so relaxing and a car ride four to five hours you need this it also is Bluetooth so you can connect it to your phone to listen to videos or movies or music. So this here is the way I'm keeping a nice and clean. I have some Lysol wipes inside the pouch. The pouch just ensures that the wipes are staying nice and moisturized. They don't actually dry out. I keep one on my luggage, one on my travel bag and it's great for just cleaning off surfaces. I got the pouch from Amazon and actually it just connects to anything you need it to connect to so this day and age um, it's always good to wipe things down to make sure that we're protecting ourselves from viruses, bacteria and just dirt just in general. Um, I don't go nowhere when, it's tra when it comes to traveling without my Lysol wipes like that is a must. This is pre-COVID I've always been this way so now I'm gonna start packing everything I'm gonna make sure I'm taking my portable battery that's the first thing I'm packing because without it um, you know I can't I can't charge anything so yeah I'm gonna make sure I'm packing up my bag making sure I have everything I need for when I need it make sure that I have all my comfort items and everything is all good I don't want it to be too heavy so this is the perfect bag for the perfect size and yeah I want to make sure that um, yeah, I'm staying nice and comfortable the little pouch on the outside I'm just putting my my little wallet and I'm putting an extra mask to make sure that I have um, backup just in case I need it so one other way I'm making sure I'm staying germ free is to bring my germ nerd so what this is it attaches to your bag and you can actually use it for computer screens you could use it for the door to open the door so no more just grabbing tissue when you're coming out the bathroom to touch surfaces you just use this you attach it to your bag it extends it's perfect you need everybody needs one of these so this actually is a beach trip but unfortunately it's not that warm it's going to be in the 70s so I am actually taking um, a lot of linens and a lot of jeans 
um, and things of that sort so um, but that's okay you know I still plan to walk on the beach I still plan to be out and about um, just not the you know the way I originally desired it to be which is I wanted to be in shorts but I am bringing um, some shorts as um, backup I'm bringing a sweater so just in case it's a little cool I'm packing a few lightweight um, blouses and t-shirts that could coincide with my jeans and my shorts shall I be able to wear them and that's it I'm not taking too much we are going out one night um, and uh, I actually bought a jumper and that's gonna go into this pouch besides that when we talk about accessories I'm bringing one dressy bag this is a charger for my iPhone I love this because it just connects to the bottom of the phone you don't need no wires it's pretty small and it fits in every bag this here is for my sunglasses so the way this works is you put one side um, outside of your shirt and in the back there's a magnet and you just put it on the back of your blouse and you just insert the legs of the sunglasses in between so this is to ensure that you don't lose your sunglasses so I'm gonna pack this and put this in this bag because most likely I'll be you know using it um, with the bag and so I have a pouch here I'm just gonna pack it all up and make sure I'm protecting it because the bag is acrylic now I have another bag that's actually for just you know more leisure like when we go hanging out if I'm in you know jeans and, and shorts and things of that sort and it actually has two sides so I love this little bag now this thing here is how you travel with your beach hats you just clip it to your bag and voila so for shoes, I'm actually just taking a few pairs, but this is how I actually pack them. I put them in my shoe bags and voila. So comfort is important to me. I like to be comfortable on, on vacay. So I'm taking these little um, travel slipper socks. So I make sure that number one, I'm not barefooted and two, I'm nice and comfortable. The second thing I'm taking for comfort is my portable latte stirrer here. So um, at the place they have a Keurig machine and I don't, I don't, you know, I need my, I need my lattes. So I'm taking this with me um, to make sure that I can have a nice latte when I want one. So if I'm going to have a latte, I need to bring my stuff because they're not supplying anything, just the Keurig machine. So here I have my travel collapsible cup. So this is perfect if I want to make some coffee and we got to run out or I want to, you know, take coffee in the car or take coffee for my, you know, on my way back home. I have it. I just take some lemon sticks. I'm actually going to pack that. I'm going to pack my collapsible cup in this little plastic bag. I have some tea packets because I like to drink tea, especially at night. Um, I have a little bit of sugar for my coffee and then I have my Dunkin Donuts um, cake cups. So I am all set. So if I need tea, if I want coffee, I have it. I don't have to go anywhere or running anywhere to buy it. So when you're doing a road trip, you need food or I need food. It's a must. This is a little organizer that you could clip to the back of the seat. It actually is insulated in the inside and I'm going to be taking some goodies. I have like little Oreos and just like chips and all this, you know, road trip stuff. It is my time to just relax. I have like miniature waters and then just miniature cans of Pepsi. I don't like fast food so I'm actually going to be cooking some pasta and just putting it in here so it can stay nice and insulated and then on, on the side I'm going to be packing my gold stack and I'm going to fill that with some healthy snacks so I can make sure that I have everything I need while on the road. So guys, that concludes this video. That's everything I'm packing for my three-day getaway. I hope you found it useful. I hope you found it um, helpful. I hope you found some tips on how to keep yourself organized. And I will see you in my next one. Love and light.